Broadcast Boys vs. The Newman Family, the final chapter. So Papa Newman Fugazi LeVar Ball just can't quit the game. He sends me a photo of a Hello Newman's billboard outside a musty-ass Canal Street station. Coincidentally, the capital of fraudulent merchandise in the world. The Ball family are Birkin bags. Y'all are L.L. Bean. God damn. He sends me an article from 2013. Age and size stand out, but so does talent. Why are you living in the past, dog? Ten years ago, I was terrorizing college campuses. You don't see me handing out my resume to anyone who passes by. Although I should. Shit. Things have gotten so desperate he sends me a prodigy prep boxer brief. These are low-key fire. I would definitely take a discount code. He says, let's not talk about Jaden. It's about damn time. You're so busy playing lockdown defense on your own son, you can't even mention the golden child of your own family. You call yourself a girl, dad? Come on now. Says you can show negative plays of everyone. We've shown enough negative plays of Julian. What about you, Papa Newman? Hold up. Why are you in the Fashion Nova Joe Butterfit in the locker room? How are you on the sidelines in this? Looking like a thot. God damn, daddy, chill. Why are you stripping? Now let's talk about the white boy video. That white boy is Puerto Rican. He's playing D1 basketball. While y'all are faking contracts in Australia, declaring for the draft for publicity, I would say 4-1-3 got the win at the end of the day. Here's Julian's last high school game. He had a 46-point performance versus Inspire Academy. Why do you only play creative schools. What are these teams? Zion Harmon and Jalen Green all on hand to watch his performance. And Mason Plumley drops 10 points in front of Kid Rock. You don't see him flexing? Stay humble. We know Julian played high school basketball since fifth grade. Not seven years of high school. Hold up. That's actually eight years of high school. You don't got a calculator on your next tell boost? It's simple arithmetic. At this point, I know what game you're playing. So Papa Newman, let's squash this beef once and for all because I'm tired of dunking on your ass.